opening day at Del Mar. <laughs> Yep, it's officially back. Fox Size Other Lake and Eric Richards are there at the track this morning to give us a preview of the big day. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. It is all about not only the horses, but the fashion and, of course, the food and the beverages. Now, if you come out today, 22,000 people, it is sold out for opening day. Wow. But opening day weekend, Eric, there is still so much to do, including grabbing a bite to eat that we're going to show you right here. It smells so good. Chef Aaron right here, Eric Brand with the Brand Beef Experience. Good morning to you both. Uh, what are we talking about today? What are we cooking? There's a lot to see. There is, and uh, Del Mar, nothing better, to, no, no better place to be than here in Del Mar, the racetrack. We got the Brand Beef Experience. We're proud to continue our sponsorship here with the racetrack, and Chef Barry Schneider, uh, runs this whole food and beverage out here, but we've got lots of ex fun, exciting things uh, coming this year. Um, so here we have some brand beef steaks. We have uh, at the Turf Club, we have the brand beef Turf Club steak night uh, every Friday night, and that's where you can get all natural brand prime beef. Nice. We are uh, we missing out. Hold on. We are missing right. out on the situation that's happening over <laughs> here. Fred Flintstone's breakfast is being made. By I was going to say, are you smelling this? Aaron, and it oh smells my gosh. so good. So you said Friday, the Turf Club. Yep. Friday. And then if we don't go to the Turf Club, I know a lot of people don't go to the Turf Club. They just get to come out and hang out. Do we get to still enjoy a little bit of the, the new Brant beef experience? Absolutely. We've got Ranch 45 uh, uh, up on the third floor, serves burgers. Wow. Hot dogs and also the uh, tri-tip sandwich. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay, that's what we're talking about right here. Yeah, it's it's oh. awesome. Then uh, we're right over here at Green Flash, uh, the Carvery. You can get a tri-tip sandwich or uh, corned beef. And really exciting this year, we've got Tanner's Prime Burgers uh, just launching, and so that's at the Celebrity Grill. And I've got to tell you, you guys got to go try it. It is probably, I, well, I'm obviously partial, <laughs> right? I know, but right? I think it's one of the best burgers in the planet. And you can get an ice cream uh, cookie sandwich oh my too. Gosh, there's oh. more with, made with beef towel. I noticed um, that you opened made a with... bottle of that wine over there too. So um, if you don't mind talking about what you like pairing this with, Ooh. if you are um, so inclined well, and course. visiting for a day of you know maybe some, some couple of beverages, food, yeah. right? a little uh, red wine goes perfect with that steak that Chef Aaron's cooking over there. Oh my so. goodness, this looks so, so good. Can you talk about um, Brent Beef? As soon as you started bringing the meat up here, you said you know we actually have specific feed. The cows aren't from very far away. You guys have a whole system sustainability project going on. Could you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, absolutely. So this is the feed that we have. This is uh, this feed is what equals prime beef. So gotcha. you got the animals that my my family raises. So I'm third generation cattle rancher. Oh, cool. Just, just two hours east of here in the Imperial Valley is where we raise these beautiful animals. This is the feed. My brother grows all the alfalfa, sedan grass, and Bermuda grass that wow. goes in there. Mixed with some steam flake corn. All natural, hormone free equals that. I'm trying to focus on you, but boy, that has my attention. Better. Oh my I gosh. Stop just it all smelling smells that enjoying that. so wow. good. I think it's a good idea too that we've got the fun little, the rolls and the thing. Now yeah. you said the, the biggest thing that we want to do here is you make sure that it's just slow, slow. salt and pepper and let it rest. And let it rest. How yeah. long? Yeah. Uh, so for a steak this size, I'd let it rest about 15 minutes. Okay. So you cook it to about 115 for mid rare. Let it rest 15 minutes and then slice away. So that sounds like my weekend. Salt and pepper and let it rest. <laughs> let it rest. Okay. okay. <laughs> let it can, can we try? Yeah, what was the sauce that you put on there? That's a little bit of horseradish mayo. These okay. are tallow rolls that we make at Ranch 45. Okay. So tallow is made from the trimmings of all the beef. And yeah. uh, so it's a play on a Parker house roll. Nice. A little bit of arugula. I love what you guys are doing here. Okay, so it is kind of funny to be all dressed up, right? And you got your heels on and your hat, and then you're Let's just mowing down on a piece <laughs> of steak. But you know what? When in Rome, here we go. Oh my gosh. This looks like it's not going to be that easy to eat. I keep looking at the rolls, too. Oh my gosh. Christina, Charlie, what do you think? Oh. Oh. Really? What do I'm gonna I do? I'm going to do all this. I know Eric's on like a. He's on like a workout program. I'm like, I'll do the tasting. Yeah, you I'm do. good. I got you, girl. I got you. I got this. Oh I'm my in God. the same boat as Heather. Well, yeah, me too. Join uh, me. Uh, Breakfast. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> She don't let me party alone. Right. Yeah, have some wine. I love that it's a small portion, too. Come on. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> enjoy. I mean, if I'm going to talk with my mouth full, I might as well right? enjoy with friends. There you I'll go. I'll see you guys back here in a little oh, bit. Ladies. We've got more racing to talk about. It sounds good. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Cheers.